It's Prince Leo! He's like a real life Prince Charming! Ah! I know, right? And look at Prince Malik's smile! It's like sunshine on a cloudy day! <laughs> I wish he could look my way just once! with all the fuss. Hmm. I guess some people just go crazy for royalty. Ugh. The way they drool over them is traumatizing to see. But you know what they say, Em. You can't buy love with a tiara. <laughs> exactly. I'd rather have someone who can make me laugh than someone who just has a fancy title. You know what? I have something even more special. <laughs> Check this out. Hey, Skipper! Look! I'm a princess too! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Emily. You're definitely the queen of comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, your highness. Well, well. Looks like we have a feisty princess here. Sorry, boys, but I'm more into guys who can make me laugh, not just guys with princely charm. <laughs> exactly. Emily is the most popular girl around here, and none of you can ever impress her enough, because she's not like any of the other popular mean girls. That sounds exciting. Well, challenge accepted. We'll have you laughing in no time. And we'll make sure to impress you enough, Miss Popular. It's Emily. Emily Brown? It's a pleasure to meet you girls. But we should be heading to our class now. See ya. Let's go, guys. Wait, but... Let's go already. <laughs> Fine. Whatever. <sighs> Just as I had expected them to be. Those little jerks. Hmm, you're right, Emily. But hey, those are the princes, so please don't try to do anything stupid, because then you might actually get into really big trouble. Uh, I don't care about them, Skipper. All I know is that I have to study hard so that I can help with my mom's medical bills. I obviously don't have time to deal with them. Anyways, let's not waste much time. Let's head to class now. I know, right? I love the new Skibbity show. It was so fascinating. That's so true. It seemed like Kosa Sparkle worked too hard on it. <laughs> no wonder why we love all her movies. Hey, beautiful M. Can I have a little talk? What is your problem, guys? What do you want to talk about? We were thinking, wouldn't it be cool if you married one of us? <gasps> Whoa, that's quite a proposal. Are you guys in your senses right now? Mary, I barely know you guys. Come on, we have the whole world around us. We can give you everything you ask for. Ugh, don't listen to him, Emily. Even his dad doesn't want him around. But my family, they're the richest people back in UAE. Uh, just so you guys should know, Emily will never be impressed by your wealth. That's why we want to impress her. Okay, well, if you don't like wealth, I'm sure you're going to like this. You love music, right? Watch me play my guitar. Make it stop! It's going to burn my ears! Stop it already! Are they even serious? <laughs> Seems like it. <laughs> Better luck next time, buddy. Anyways, Em, that was pretty awful, I know. So check out my incredible dancing skills! Ow! Bruh. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> this is getting interesting. <clears throat> okay, okay, guys. That's enough with the music and dancing. This is getting weird. I'm gonna leave now. Wait, no, no, Emily. Just give us a chance. We can show you how great we are. What is wrong with the both of you? Why are you guys even trying to impress me? I'm not interested in any of you. <sighs> Look, I'm not some prize to be won in a talent show. I have a say in who I marry. Do you get me? So stop this act already. We just wanted to impress you and make you happy. I have better goals in my life than to date any of you. And marriage? I'm far beyond that turn of my life, so please, give me some space already. <sighs> She's so impossible to impress. It's weird how she won't be impressed by all of this. Any girl would die to have this opportunity. Um, guys, that was a nice job, but hey, you should just be genuine and get to know her better first, don't you think? Exactly! Real connections come from getting to know each other, not with some clumsy dance moves. You're right. We shouldn't have rushed things. Maybe we need to take some time to be friends first and see where it goes. But hey, you girls are her best friends, right? Can you help us with any ways to impress her? Well, we're not pretty sure how you guys can actually impress her, but Skipper is her best friend, and I'm sure she knows her a lot more than anyone else. I guess that's it. Done. We have a new mission now. Find Skipper and ask about Emily's secrets. Hey, Skipper! I need your help. It's an emergency. Sure, Leo. What's up? Well, you see, I really like Emily. And I want to impress her so I can marry her. Can you tell me what she likes? Wait, 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 wait. What now? Marry her? Whoa, hold on. Why do you want to marry Emily all of a sudden? <laughs> well, I think she's amazing. I can't imagine my life without her. Um, you do realize that you just met her, right? <sighs> just tell me already. Oh, um, you know, Emily is just into regular stuff. Nothing special. Come on, Skipper. I really need your advice. Wouldn't you want your best friend to date a hot guy like me? Uh-huh. Sure, sure. Um, I... Well, I guess she likes flowers and chocolates. But who doesn't, right? Flowers and chocolates. Got it. What else? Oh, Leo, I have to finish these books, but... You should just be yourself, and I'm sure Emily will like you just the way you are. Hey, I want to do something more special. Please, Skipper, help me out here. <sighs> all right, all right. You can also try writing her a cute poem or singing her a silly song. A silly song, huh? Got it. Thanks, Skipper. You're the best. Yeah, yeah, whatever's. Just remember to keep it fun and lighthearted. I will. Thanks again, Skipper. You're a lifesaver. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be fun. <laughs> hey there. Are you okay, little one? Oh, um, I'm fine. Thank you. Hey, are you sure? You seem a little down. Well, I... I was hoping to buy a snack for my little sister, but I don't have enough money. Oh, I see. Hey, but don't worry, I can help you out. Oh, oh my god, thank you so much! You're really nice! You're welcome. It's always good to lend a helping hand. Make sure to get yourself and your sister a good snack, okay? <laughs> yes, I will. Thank you very much once again. <sighs> wow, she's not just an ordinary person. She's someone really special. <sighs> I really hope she likes it. Hey, Emily, I got something for you. Uh huh? Uh, 
Leo, right? <clears throat> Prince Leo, you mean. Isn't that the same? Anyways, what's up? I heard you like flowers and chocolates, so I thought I'd surprise you. Flowers and chocolates! Huh. How original. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yes! The fun begins here! Well, um, do you like them? You know, it's not just about flowers and chocolates. You should know me better before trying to impress me. Uh, I don't get why all of you are suddenly trying to impress me so hard. I just wanted to make you happy, Skipper said. Skipper said? You listen to Skipper? Dude, she always chokes around about that because I know my best friend. She'll never expose my secret. Well, maybe you should have asked me directly instead of blindly following her advice. Looks like Prince Leo's love advice didn't work out. Poor guy. He should have known better. Figure things out for yourself next time, Prince Leo. And don't try to come to see me anymore with these useless presents now. I'm sorry, Emily. I messed up. Emily! Wait! No! <laughs> Looks like Prince Leo's romantic gesture backfired big time! Leo, I'm really sorry. I really thought... <sighs> it's alright, Skipper. I should have known better than to trust advice from someone else. I didn't mean to cause you any trouble. I'll try to make it up to you. Maybe you can help me figure out a better way to impress Emily next time. I need to leave now. See ya. No, wait, Leo! <sighs> oh no, that wasn't good. Mom? How are you feeling? I'm hanging in there, sweetheart. It's just been tough lately. I'm so happy to see you here, though. I'm so sorry you're going through this. I wish I could take away all of your pain. I'm still here for you, though. I'm working day and night for you, Mom. You'll be okay soon. Don't worry. Oh, honey, you being here is enough. It brings me comfort and strength. I don't ask for more. Just focus on yourself and your studies. No, Mom, of course. I care about you a lot. I can't imagine losing you, Mom. You're everything to me. And you are everything to me too, my dear. But you're strong, and I know you'll be okay. You'll be a successful doctor one day. It's just... It's hard to see you like this. I know, sweetheart, but we have to be brave together. I've had a good life, and I'm proud of the person you've become. I love you so much, Mom. I wish Dad were here too. I miss him every day. He was a wonderful husband and father, but he's watching over us from up there, I believe. I wish he could have seen me grow up, studying so hard, working at the same time. Your father would have been so proud of you, Emily. You've achieved so much, and you have a bright future ahead. It's just hard sometimes, Mom. I feel like the weight of the world is on my shoulders. You're strong, my love, and I know you'll get through anything life throws at you. Just remember, I'll always be with you, even if I'm not physically here. Please don't say it like that, Mom. I don't know how I'll cope without you, Mom. You know, when everyone in the school thinks that I'm the happiest person ever, they're all wrong. They don't know the pain I'm going through. The pain of seeing you like this. You'll find the strength within yourself, Emily. You have your friends and me here with you. I'm so grateful for you, Mom. You've always been my rock star. 
And you've been mine, my dear. You've brought so much joy into my life. I was so wrong about this girl. She's such a sweetheart. Why are we even doing this to her? No, I won't let this happen. I'll fix everything. Fantasize about it all the time if you were mine. <laughs> hey again, Emily. Guess what? I wrote this song just for you. <sighs> Malik, I told you before. I'm not interested in the song right now. Let me finish my artwork. <laughs> How about I play you some more guitar? Trust me, it's the best one I've got. You're gonna love it. Ugh, come on! Don't you guys get it? I don't want to listen to your dumb music! I- That's enough! Both of you! Leave her alone! What's your problem, Leo? What is your problem, man? Can't you see that Emily isn't interested in your moves? We're just trying to win her over. Well, it's not working. You're only making her upset. So just leave her alone already. Leo, why are you getting involved? Because I can't stand seeing you bothered by their stupidity. Oh yeah? So, what do you suggest, Mr. Know-It-All? We all know that's why you're here. You're also involved in this, aren't you? Just... shut up. How about you back off and leave her alone? Uh, Leo, you don't need to be so harsh. I'm sorry, Emily. I just want to protect you from their pushiness. Well, if you're so sure you can do better, why don't you try? Fine, I will. But not to impress her or win some competition. I'll just be myself. What do you mean? Let's all go on a date with Emily. One by one. No pressure. Just getting to know each other. A date competition? I like the sound of that. Yeah, may the best man win! You know, that might not be a bad idea. Great, so we're all in an agreement? So, Malik, what are your hobbies? I don't have time for hobbies. I have more important things to do. Oh, okay. Well, maybe we can talk about your interests then? Well, I'd say my interests are too sophisticated for you to understand. Um, alright. Let's talk about something else then. Here's your order. Enjoy your meal. Finally! It took you forever! Malik! That's not nice! He's just doing his job! Oh well, he should do it faster. Um, I'm so sorry about that, sir. I'll be careful next time. Call me if you need anything. Malik, I don't think this is going well. You're being very rude. I don't care what you think. <laughs> Excuse me? How are you talking to me like that? You were the one who wanted me on this date. Why are you showing me so much attitude? Well, what can I do? You told me to be myself. That's exactly what I'm doing. That's enough. I can't continue this date if you're going to be disrespectful. I'm leaving. No, wait! Emily, come back! Ugh. So Kai, tell me about yourself. <sighs> Where do I start? I'm the best soccer player to my school, and I've won several awards. That's impressive, but I'd love to know more about your other interests, too. I'm also the lead in the school play. Everyone says I'm a natural actor. That's really... And did I mention my amazing grades? I'm at the top of my class. <laughs> Kai, I'd like to... Plus, I'm great at singing, and I can play three musical instruments. Kai! <sighs> I want to talk too! Oh, sorry, go ahead. <sighs> it's okay. I just wish we could have a conversation, not just you talking about yourself. Well, I'm just trying to impress you with all of my talents. <sighs> you know what? If you're going to continue talking about yourself, then I don't need you here. I'm leaving! Bye! No, wait, Lily! I mean, Emily, wait for me! <laughs> I know, right? Those two are terrible. 
They were just putting up those acts so that they could get me to date them and eventually marry them. Ugh. <laughs> I guess, but hey, are you ready to see Leo tomorrow? He's a bit different, in case you didn't know. You're right. I do have a good feeling about him. He is nice, like you said. <laughs> Ooh, it seems like someone is very much excited. <laughs> oh, well, we gotta wait till tomorrow to find out. <laughs> yeah, but hey, did you finish the economics assignment? Oh, yeah, I'm almost there. Hmm. He's not here yet. Is he even going to show up? But Lo, let's head outside. I'll explain everything. Are you going to explain now? First, I'm so sorry for not showing up on the date. You see, while I was leaving the house, I saw this woman down the street, and I knew for sure that it was your mom. She almost got into a car accident, but thankfully, I was able to save her, but she still somehow fainted. So I decided to bring her to the hospital and get her all checked up, and took her back home. I'm so sorry. I should have told you. You did... what? Why would you do that? Because I had seen you with your mom at the hospital that day. I truly felt bad for both of you. That's why when I decided that I will not try to keep on with this bet. A bet? What kind of bet? It's the kind of bet we all had. Me, Malik, and Kai. The winner would get to marry the princess, but honestly, I don't care about it anymore. I truly love you and your personality, Emily. You're really caring and special. Thank you so much, Leo. Thank you so much for saving my mom's life. I would have never been able to forgive myself if I had lost her. I'm sorry if I ever did anything to wrong you. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for agreeing with this stupid bet. But hey, I love you so much now. I love you so much too, Leo. I knew from the beginning that you're the only one for me. Thank you so much for coming into my life. 